Now that's what I call a successful recon. Very happy with that. Birdcage found. I know what enemies I'm going to be up against. And I got an iron sword out of it. So. Area 1. You've got quite a lot to live up to. Let's see whether or not you deliver. I'm already sort of making plans as to how to get that bird cage. It's probably going to be very similar to the method I used in the unholy ghost on the other world. Because I've got the cobble, I've got the iron, I've got the redstone. Fire potion or two would be nice, but you never know, there's still time possibly to come across those things. Now, this shouldn't be as far because I could see the beginnings of that area from Shellshock Island. Ah, it isn't very far. Here we are. It doesn't look none too exciting. Apart from I've run out of rail track. Or rather, I haven't run out of rail track. Looks like it's been broken. Interesting. And Sydney, it just seems to be a. Well, nothing. Well, there must be something there, so. Let me wait until I can get a closer look. Bit of luck, there'll be a railway repair kit in that chest. I don't really want. No, I won't have to walk back, will I? I can always give the. Wagon a shove and leap into it. Solid ground. Oh, it is. Fantastic. Ah, this looks like gravel. It is gravel. And this shape is very familiar as well. Last time I saw that shape was at Bad Dreams. And it does indeed look like it's been blocked up, maybe in a hurry. So maybe whatever's out there has caused the breakup of the railway. The only thing I know that would do with that is ghasts. Oh joy. Ah, all right. Water. Water flowing down. Water flowing down a long way. Water flowing from a long way up. So, lots of towers. Broken walkways. That fits in with the broken rail line. One there that I could possibly get to just by swimming along to it. I wonder if I should. Can I get to that one? No, that's too far out. Well, seeing as I'm here, I think I really should do. So I better arm myself just in case. Oh, yes. Yes, that'll do. That'll do very nicely. No mobs, though. Unless... Ah, uh, sun's right overhead, so maybe it's just too bright for them. Squiddy in the distance. Something big up there. Can't quite see properly what it is. Actually, it looks a little like the bat signal to me. Maybe I'll have a better idea when I'm up, when I'm up top. So I guess if I go through, if I come across on the surface, if I'm not careful, I could suddenly find myself plummeting over the edge. I shall have to watch that. 
Anything over? Oh, hello. Party time. Oh, yeah. Obviously, you can't spawn out here, so you're all going in there. And I was right about the ghasts. So I would guess also there's a very good chance that they're going to be in each and every one of these towers. Well, that'll give me something to look forward to. I can't see any visible means of getting in from the bottom. And I can't honestly tell whether that's water down on the very bottom. Or is it blue wool? No, I think it's blue wool. No. I mean, I think it's water. I won't jump down there and test it, just in case it's only shallow. So, right, there's not a lot I'm going to be able to do here. I don't really fancy... Well, I could snipe them all, I suppose, but... No. No, I'd rather get back... Ooh, things falling off. No, I'd rather get back, repair this railway, and get myself over to Area 2, and make a serious effort at finding this disc. Right, I've made it back here at last. First thing I want to do is find the area marker. So I can find what this place is called. And I suspect it's that in the middle of the middle of the big lake. Yeah. And that looks possibly like a chest up there. And up there as well. Good. Can't see anything else that immediately stands out. Apart from, apart from that, definitely looks like some sort of craft to me. So, sub area. Who's that? Who's that? Ancient visitors. Right. What's this got to say? Search for days. Not seems like endless ocean of water. So it's a jungle here. They farm, they build, they thrive. Feels like they're being watched. Watched from up there, I would imagine. Right. You stay there a moment, boat. I need to try and get my bearings here big column of water going down that's fine but where exactly was I right little sandy beach over there and that was just opposite where I was mining which was around there so the rail line must be sort of under that cliff there, going all the way along back there. Um, I'm sure I may as well go up this way to get to that chest, haven't I? So, the big box thing that I saw hanging down must be over there somewhere in that case. Don't check that out. And of course the only, only nuisance with all these animals around is that I never know whether it's just the animals walking about or whether it's a hostile mob about to sneak up on me. That'll do nicely. I'll take the whole lot. Chests are always useful. 
wondering whether I can get up to that. Possibly from the top of one of these hills. Might be. Might be the answer. Rather than going up. Oh, I forgot this isn't as deep. Rather than having to go up that column of water, wondering whether if I could maybe climb to the top of that tree and do a little bridge across and see if there's a way in from above. If not, I'll have to go all the way down to the bottom and try and swim up that water column. But I would rather not do that if I can avoid it. Right, out. What's up in this one then? Still an awful lot of these cats around. And I'm going to need to go in search of search of some livestock. I could do with a little bit of meat to supplement my diet. And I think the sun's about to go down. Yes, I'll take all those as well. Should be able to fit it all in. Yes. Right, yes, sun's definitely going down now. So I think I ought to have a good night's sleep and then continue my search in the morning. Ah, oh, that's better. I feel much more refreshed now. So, I haven't been around this side yet. And, oh, it's a cow. Oh, well done, Daisy. Good girl, you stay there. Excellent. And another chest. Double excellent. Skelly up there. I know. But that's that's interesting though. Looks like looks like there's been an explosion here, but I don't see what could have caused it. Couldn't have been a creeper skelly explosion because I haven't been round here for for a skelly to shoot at anything. Interesting. Well, I'd better go and see what's there. I ought to have a bit of breakfast, really. Is it just down here? Yes. That was a pressure plate. And that... Oh! Hello. Have I got spawners here? I'm looking for your mate. I don't know where he's gone. Oh, in there. That's definitely a pressure plate. It's obviously not doing anything. Oh, definitely spawners in there then. Okay. 
Yeah. I'm going to get some torches on those. What's that all about then? Check that out in a moment. Anybody else lurking around here? No? Right. Oh, wow. Look at all that. Oh, fantastic. Well, that can stay there for the moment. I'll collect it after I've investigated around the island a little bit more. Pressure plate might come in handy, though. So, that must have been linked to something. Ah, redstone, right. So, there must have been TNT here, then. But why would... Why would I put it right next to a spawner? Unless it was due to catch me out as I sailed past. Maybe. Curious. Oh well. I'll count my blessings that it didn't get me. Looks like something else there as well. Oh look, the poor little sheep stuck down there. Oh well, hard luck. At least you've got a skelly for company. Right, onwards. Right, establish there's nothing over there. Yeah, don't worry, Chicky, I've got some wheat on the go. I will be back for you. Trust me on that. That one I collected earlier. Doesn't seem to be much here. Maybe this is right at the other side. Oh! <laughs> yes, there is. seem to be anything guarding this one. Okay, always useful. Um, again, I may as well have you. Thank you. Oh, this is going very nicely. Loads of stuff here. certainly have no problem getting any wood from around here if I need to supplement what I've got on Shell Shock Island. Keep seeing odd little patches of coal all dotted around. This looks like as far as it goes. Are you on Big Island, or...? Nothing there. Another sheep. Those are sheeps. More cats. Can I manoeuvre my way in here? If I'm very, very careful. I'm sure I can. Not without getting out and digging. That should do. And a piggy. Excellent. Well done, Mr. Pig. I hope you have a friend somewhere. I'm sure there'll be more than one. At 
Hello? 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 What the hell is that? It's a dirty great sword. Now that is interesting. Well, that's the first first built thing I've seen. Settlers said they built here, but... Oh, and another marker. Alrighty. Oh, wow. Oh, will you look at that? Ah, oh, there's another cow. Good. Sub area, Lake of the Fallen Twins. Is there another note? There is. More discovery of native builds. This lake appears to be a tomb for a being or beings of high regard. Sword like structure tells us the warrior's memorial. Discover this grave is a haunted and evil place. Our archaeologists are unable to dig deep enough to find the relics of a native culture. So it's not built by the settlers then. Well, let's go on a little sail around it. Wow. Looks like I might be able to just possibly sail straight in. Anything else hidden around here? Yes, it's another chest over there. Goodness me. Is that another one there? This really is a treasure trove. Yes, it is. Right, I'll just leave him parked here. And skip across these. Another sheep. And a jack o' lantern. Why would there be a jack o' lantern here? More armour and bread. Oh, don't tell me you're getting dark already. No, no, no. Well, no, not so bad. Goodness me, the days in this world, they go so quickly. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. Right, I'll come back to that one then. Come back to this again in the morning. The mobs seem to be getting more hostile day by day. I was attacked by quite a few on my way back last night. Thankfully though, I soon showed them who was boss. Now, to the matters of the day. First of all, check this chest out. And then on to a little bit of tomb raiding. Something I haven't done in a very long while. Oh, little kitten! And big gold. Oh, wow. Oh my god. And, and, and cave spiders, I think. Cave spiders in a cave. 
Okay, guys, go away. Go on, scoot. Uh, shooting your boat isn't going to help you. No, it's not, is it? This sword will, because that's... I think this sword's got arachnophobia on it, or... Whatever the thing is called. So, I better get in there and get some light down. As quickly as I possibly can. What a nuisance that water's in the way. Right, here I go. Where are I? Ooh, you're up above. Okay, I see you now. Yes, I see you now. Right. Get off. Alright. Up there. Even if that only just slows them down for a moment. Oh, my goodness me. Maybe I can get up there to them. Possibly. Oh, hello. You caught me from behind. Right. Let me get my strength up. Okay, kids. You lot ain't gonna last. So I'm probably opening, opening myself up to all of them now. Okay, 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 that's it, you lot stay up, you lot stay up above, stay up above, and we'll all get along swimmingly, one more, hopefully one more, and it's all gone quiet over there, oh yes, just call me the Spider King. Right, all the gold and everything I shall come back to later. Hello, out the way. There, yes, you can make a little home in here if you want. Right, let me check out this chest. Alright, always useful. Arrows, very, very useful. Yeah, they will come in, they will come in handy. Now, I think I saw, I saw jack-o'-lanterns outside that other chest that was over there. Maybe there's a little hidden cave there that I didn't notice last time. Look, more kittens. I shall check that out later, though. And I also think I saw a plaque up on the roof of this. So I'd better just check before I actually go inside. Yes, thought I had. What does it say? The Super Sword of Mr. Foot. Well, I've heard of the legends of Mr. Foot, but I always thought they were just a myth. Just stories told by travellers in dusty taverns. So maybe, maybe this tomb will reveal the truth. Very dark in there. Very dark. Oh! There's someone in here. Oh, 